Hello everyone, my name's Michelle McManus and I'm so excited that I'm getting to read this fantastic story with you. When I was a wee girl, I used to love reading stories with my friends, with my sisters, with my mum and dad. Uh, so the book that I've chosen today is Jonathan the Magic Pony. Now it's been written by Stuart Heritage and illustrated by Nicola Slater. And this is all thanks to the people at Children First and the Dolly Parton Imagination Library. So if you've got your books ready, everyone, let's find out about this magic pony. Here we go. Jonathan the Pony had a very special talent. Oh, <gasps> he was a magic pony. With one wave of his wand, he could make anything disappear. Watch this. See, the frog is gone. But don't worry, because whenever Jonathan waved his wand again, three, two, one, everything came back. Everything always came back because Jonathan was a brilliant magician. So when Jonathan, the magic pony, made Sarah's bear disappear, it came straight back. Except, that's not my bear, said Sarah. My bear is red. This bear is blue. Oh, said Jonathan. Well, not to worry. These things happen sometimes. So he raised his wand high in the air and... That's not my bear either, said Sarah. That's a duck. Oh, oh, I know it's a duck, said Jonathan. It's part of the trick. And now for your bear. Three, two, one. No, said Sarah. That's a shark. Are you sure you're a magician? Oh, yes. Yes, definitely a magician, said Jonathan quickly. What a show this is. Now, here's your bear. Three, two, one. No, that's a moth. No, that's a sloth. That's a lamb. That's a clam. No, that's a calf. That's a giraffe. That's a raccoon. That's a baboon. And that's a wooden spoon. Oh, it was the last straw. I want my bear, cried Sarah. Jonathan closed his eyes. He took a deep breath. It was a very important moment. Three, two, one. <laughs> no, it was a chimpanzee covered in fleas. Oh, you're not a good magician, cried Sarah. <laughs> but just then, a flea jumped on to Jonathan's nose. Get off, get off! Oh, oh, it tickles! Jonathan started to sneeze. Huh, huh, huh. Achoo! <laughs> Whoops. Jonathan's sneeze had made everything disappear. Even Jonathan. But not Sarah. And the wand was still here too. Sarah looked at it. What should she do? You guessed it. Three, two, one. It worked. You found my bear, said Sarah. No, you found your bear, said Jonathan. Sarah laughed. <laughs> Turns out I'm the magician, she said. Oh, fine, said Jonathan. Magic's rubbish anyway. I want to be... A superhero! 
oh, there was a brilliant book and Sarah got her bear back. And it turned out that she was a magician after all. Was that not brilliant? Jonathan the Magic Pony. Oh, listen, thanks everybody for reading that book with me. If you want some more information about this great initiative from Children First and the Dolly Parton Imagination Library, all you have to do is head to childrenfirst.org.uk. Thanks so much for reading the book with me. Bye.